the Hemsworth Town Maiden. One of the longer races on the card this week. Three mile and one furlong. Ah, oh, maybe not so long. So at 5,000 metres. Uh, so up the top there's Bull 5 for P. Hannon. Good to see you back. As for Rowe, years in the making, Tillsworth, Glenboy, Yu Half, Mighty Dev, Joala, Maclet, Lions Golf, Lord Babushka, uh, Ear to the Ground, French Sword, Zelda de Moy, Blind Faith, Sphinx Waltzing, Iron World, and Pulling Your Leg Master for Pontypool Racing. And they're off. As for Rowe was the early leader with Iron World. Jockey on years in the making of the Stronghold. Same two there for Lions Golf. Out wider we've got some horses going forward. Blind Faith, U Half. And at the tail is French Sword just biding its time. It's usually where a lot of Leon's horses settle early. He puts, uh, he puts to the sword the thought process that horses at the tail of the field who settle back are disadvantaged. Up and over the, um, what do you call that? Not the trench. Anyway, you know what I'm talking about. And as, as for Rowe in front, the ditch comes to the next, jumps it nicely. They're all over it from Blind Faith, few half years in the making. Lions Golf, Bull Five, Mighty Dev, Sphinx Waltz, Waltzing, and Iron World. Uh, Joala Maclet, Lord Babushka, Tillsworth Glenboy, Ear to the Ground, French Sword, Zelda de Moy, and Pulling Your Leg Master. One thing we do know was a fact that as soon as you hit the three mile mark, you get the pull ups. And over the fifth. And it's as for row. Leading comfortably over the sixth. A slow one there from Lions Golf, who then fell back onto Tillsworth Glenboy. Interfering with it, both horses lost their positions. Widest runner there is Zelda De Moy. So run on down to the winning post at Doncaster. And you'd say it'd be maybe a lap to go. If so, it's a big track this one. You'd almost need Hubble Telescope if you're in the stands trying to watch the horses. Especially in the back straight. And as Faro jumps the water. From Iron World, U Half, Blind Faith, Years in the Making, Sphinx Waltzing, Bull Five. Everyone's doing it nice at the moment. Uh, so as horses are in two halves here, the second half, oh one's getting pulled up here and it's Zelda de Moy. So the second half here is Mighty Dev with you to the ground, uh, Toolsworth Glenboy as they take the ditch. Lions Golf poking through and the last three are Lord Babushka, Joala Maclet and Pulling Your Leg Master. the 11th. Ooh, pecking at it, at it there was Hollywood's horse. New half. Drop back to fourth. As for Rose, jumping nice and getting pulled up as well is Martin's horse, Lord Babushka. So we've got Gray's book ending this field. As for Rowe and Joala Maclet. As for Rowe, 
running nicely. A half to Sphinx Waltzing. Pushing through. Oh, my horse is getting pulled up as well. Joala Maclet. Oh, dear. And um, so you come to the next. Up and over they go. So we've only had the three pulled up. No one's fallen or lost the jockey. And a Sphinx Waltzing poking the nose in front of Asfero. Over the ditch. And a Sphinx Walding from New Half Iron World. Bull five as for Rome. Mighty Dev out wider. Ears to the ground. Poking through there. Pulling your leg master. Making its move. Um, out wider is a French sword. Who jumped that a bit slow I believe. And it's there with um, Lions Golf and Blind Faith. But a Sphinx uh, Waltzing in front. Darren Howells will have his fingers crossed here. Getting pulled up as Blind Faith. That's Kevin's horse. Up and over the next they go. It's a funny running race. They're across the track. As for O's, retaking the lead. As they run to the three furlong. From years in the making, pulling your leg master. Sphinx waltzing, bull five. As they jump that one and pulling your leg master is our new leader at the two and a half from years in the making. Sphinx Walding battling on with Bull 5, Mighty Dev. Uh, here comes here to the ground and French Sword up and over the second last and years in the making. Just starting to pull away from pulling your leg master. Mighty Dev here to the ground. French Sword running on at the furlong. One more to get over. They come to it. Oh, and it's jumped at well, this leader, and years to the, in, in the making, he's going to win this comfortably. And it comes down, I think that's two in a row for Josh, and it is uh, from French Sword and Ears to the Ground. we both finished full of running. But another one to Josh, congratulations. Second, French Sword, William Van Rensburg. Third was Ear to the Ground, Paul Rhodes. Lion Golf was fourth and fifth was Sphinx Waltzing, Darren Howes.